Hello, how are you guys? I have missed you so much. And as you can see, I was not ready to do a video. I literally just came from a walk. And as I was walking, I was reading some of uh, the messages and some people are a little confused about the new program. And so I'm sorry if my hair and makeup is a hot mess, but I thought it was more important to come on here and give you a little bit of uh, sanity. Um, so about a month and a week ago, Weight Watchers contacted me and asked me to participate in their um, something new that they were rolling out and the first email I got I kind of thought it was a joke or something <laughs> so I didn't respond and then um, I received another email and opened it and I said oh this is real so I responded and I said of course definitely I you know I definitely want to be involved and um, I'm so glad that I did. I wasn't paid or anything for um, helping out. It was just um, we were trying to help out with the app and, you know, say what we liked, what we didn't, how it was working, you know, issues with downloading, stuff that was missing, stuff like that. So... <clears throat> I know they're still having some app problems, so if you can just hang in there, they will, um, they'll be fixing all that stuff. So, I just wanted to explain a little bit about the program. Um, it's really called Beyond the Scale, which means feeling healthy and learning ways to cope um, to cope with eating <clears throat> the right way and not leaning on our chocolates and things like that and eating healthier and, you know, feeling healthier beyond what the scale says. <clears throat> so that's the best way that I know how to say that. And they also want you to eat more protein. I mean, yes more lean protein, more fruits and vegetables, less sugar and saturated fat. So you might find that a lot of your things are high in fat, which is going to make them higher in points. Everyone does get a different amount of the weekly allowance points. It's based on your height, your weight, your gender, everything. So if you say, oh, I only have, you know, 32 points and someone else says, I have 40 points, then, excuse me, then um, you will know um, what that's about. So... My, I used to have one treat that I would have like once a week and that would be a lint bar and that's a chocolate like scrumptious bar and that went from six points to like ten so I kind of cut that out so I might have half a one and maybe half and you know the other half at another time. But how I did on Smart Points was the first week I lost four pounds. The second week I lost three pounds, three point something. And then the third week I lost like two something. So altogether I lost nine pounds. So it does work. Uh, it certainly does work. <clears throat> it is harder because you do have to calculate and make sure that you're staying, you know, on your points. And a lot, you have to 
make a lot more of your foods, um, which some people find harder to do, but there's meal prep and things that you can do that I, even I can help you out with that we can um, do together. So um, now another difference is exercise doesn't give you more points to eat. So I never liked that one. So I never counted my whatever kind of exercise I did towards that. So that was, you know, not important to me. Apparently Oprah is following the, the plan as well, which is pretty cool. And um, I have noticed the less sugar and saturated fat that I eat, then the better I feel and the less cravings that I have. So having less cravings is going to make me want to eat less. So, um, so yeah, let me know if you have that as well. And um, there's also a connect feature. <clears throat> if you've seen it on your app, which you can connect with other members almost immediately and ask questions or, you know, if you have a friend on there, you can tag up with them. It's pretty cool. And I did like that. And then, um, what else? And another thing that I suggest that you do is to go through your cabinets and to write in permanent marker on each thing that you eat because a lot of the foods have changed. Some have gone down, um, like lean meats, and some have gone up. So I would go through, because I'm so used to knowing all my points and knowing what they are, and um, and I really, you know, it was really hard for me at first because I had to go through and remark everything. My creamer went up by oh, like three points or something like that. So I did switch to sugar free. So, you know, um, I don't exactly love to do that, but you know, some sometimes you have to choose your battles, I guess you, you could say. Um, what else do I want to say? So I would like to know your first impression of the new plan. And they also got rid of the, the healthy checks. That's another thing that I wasn't thrilled with because I like to check off that I took a vitamin. I like to check off that um, I got this and that in my waters because you kind of feel, you know, what is it called? Like established. You kind of feel proud when you, when you get, um, when you get those waters in and you want to mark them off and say, hey, I did this. But I don't know if they're going to bring that back, but I think it's gone. So I'm just going to open up my app and just show you real quick. Once it comes up, um, it should look something like this. So you'll have your um, points allowance and then your weekly allowance and your activity. So there's also the weight tracker and the connect. The little connect is right there. You can see it right there. Um, like I said, that's pretty cool. I have not signed up for that. You still have your scanner. It's up here. The scanner works pretty well as far as I've seen. And <clears throat> let's see, let's try to add a new food. Oh, another thing that I like about it is that when you make recipes, they don't account for um, like the fruits and veggies that you put in them. I hated that. 
I, I didn't understand why, you know, you have your food here and say you have broccoli on the side, but if you put them both together in a recipe, then it counts as more points. I didn't get that. So I really like that change. And let's see, of course, this is an orc in for me now. Oh, yes, it is. Okay, so create. So you're going to say create and then create custom food at the bottom. I'm not at the bottom, the second one down. And there it has all your calories, fat, saturated fat, carbs. It's a lot more to input. But you know if, you, if it's zero grams of fat, then you're definitely going to have zero saturated fat. So, and once you get used to this program, it'll just become easier and easier, just like the, you know, when you first did um, Points Plus. So, I hope you all are understanding the program and um, getting used to it, and um, I will be back to starting new videos soon on my weekly weigh-ins and things like that. And uh, the reason why I was gone for so long, I will explain all of that as well. So, I love you guys dearly. Again, excuse my hair and makeup for being a hot mess. But, I, like I said, I was taking a walk and I realized that um, a lot of people were struggling with it. So, if you have any questions, put them below. I can, you know, try to answer them. If I can't answer them, I will get an answer for you. So again, I love you very much and I will see you very soon. I have missed you and um, I just love you to pieces. I really do. You guys know that. So all right, I will see you next time. I hope that was helpful. I will be doing another video soon on Smart Points. I'm still learning as well. This is, you know, something very new and it's, but you got to remember that Weight Watchers has been, you know, in business for 50 years and they've helped, you know, I don't know, millions of people lose weight. So they obviously know what they're doing. So just keep that in mind if you start to doubt the program and want to jump ship. So again, I love you and I will see you very soon. Okay. Have a great day, great night, and um, we'll talk. Bye-bye. Don't forget to comment below.